This video is for real lubrication and maintenance of the 4 inch raised pillar whether plate wind or S handle. Um, to lubricate this reel uh, it only needs to have the check gear and gears lubricated. It has sealed bearings uh, so the maintenance is fairly low. The way to tell which side to lubricate on is fairly easy. It's whatever side has the thumb screw on. The off side does not need to be lubricated. In the case of the plate wine, this could be on either side. If these handles were on the right, obviously it'd, it'd be over on this side. In the case of the S handle, whether it's right or left, the Thumb screw is always on the off side of the reel or opposite side of the handle uh, just so obviously this fixed plate doesn't have to be exposed. So in the case of uh, this S handle the back plate would come off and the reel I'm going to show you how to lubricate just because it will show up here on, on video better is this left hand dual handled uh, plate wine I have. I just use a loony, and when you back this screw out, it lifts the face plate out. It's got a captive screw, uh, and that helps it clear it. Once it's all the way out, you can take the face plate off. It's got a square brooch in there, and be reminded this back plate or face plate, it's got a uh, a two ball snowman basically the the captive screw slides into the big hole and then moves over to the center and that's what allows it to lift up or up or down the way I like to do it is once the reel is open as you can see this one is fairly clean I just take uh, some Kleenex and wipe it down clean it out, keep any grime or dirt or sand or if there's if it's too dirty, if there's a bunch of sand or grit in there, I'll, I'll rinse it out with water. It takes, it doesn't take much to keep a, a reel maintained over the year unless you're fishing 100 days a year, I think once a year would be more than adequate. I use Super Lube Synthetic Grease, and I distinguish with this one with uh, PTFE or Teflon. Uh, this grease holds up really nicely. It's um, a little bit transparent, as you can see, but it, viscosity doesn't seem to change with heat or cold weather. I actually extrude mine into a, um, a syringe. This happens to be one that uh, dentals, dentists use. And I simply take and put grease on the gears. I just go around them. Now in this case, this one is set to left-hand wind. Um, this reel can have this idle gear in either position, which would allow the the, uh, the uh, thumb screw to be right or left. Um, but anyhow, I just extrude some grease in. You can spin it around and make sure you get it on. The spots that we're contacting and then I also take the spring lift the spring up and put a touch between the pole and the spring and that's really it um, once it's cleaned out and re-lubed I line the square brooch up on the on the face plate or back plate start the screw with my fingers and as far down as it'll go, I'll do it by, by hand. And then uh, I'll use the loony 
tighten it up and that's all there is to it back in business